My name is Sister Benedicta Marie. I'm a sister of the Sister Servants of the Eternal Word in Birmingham, Alabama, and I'm Mandy's sister. M Mandy passed away recently, this year, February 7th, 2023, and her death was as her life. It was extremely beautiful, peaceful, um, joyful, full of the life and light of God. In past interviews, Mandy had said, to make things beautiful or to make a beautiful thing is to make Him known. You know, she would say that, that beauty, it's not an accessory. It's a necessity. You know, we are an incarnational people. We are, we live the faith through sacramental mediation. So everything is important and everything speaks and everything disposes us to enter into the Divine Liturgy. I know that initially she did talk with the uh, school's president, Dr. O'Donnell. He had inspiration on the redemption of nature through the Eucharist. So the depiction on the crossing tower ceiling there is symbolic of the Holy Eucharist. You'll notice around the, the gold, around where the angels are encircled, kind of a dark, a dark ring almost, and that is to symbolize the eclipse on Good Friday. And so that's the moment in which our Lord Christ the King established His reign. And, um, and you see the inner heavens, the outer heavens, the archangels, the four archangels around the corners. And those are the four angels who hold back the winds from destroying the earth that we read about in the book of Revelation. I know she considered it a, a, a tremendous honor and responsibility to be given that task. Um, and she saw Christendom as a light in the world. And so she wanted to create something worthy of the liturgy um, that would be not just beautiful, but maybe even spectacular. I think she and I have the same hope for the work that she did, that as people enter into that church and as they pray the Holy Mass and are present at the Eucharistic sacrifice, that they are truly elevated above and beyond themselves, not becoming less themselves, but actually becoming more themselves because they are worshiping the Triune God. They're present at the eternal sacrifice. They're entering beyond the veil into the heavenly sanctuary. They're united with the angels in the triple sanctus that you see around the sanctuary, their walls, the arches. And so to truly help them become disposed to that great beauty which gives glory to God and leads others to Him because that's what it's all about. Thank you.